Tyler, hey. are you ready? So ready. So ready. Here we are. Um, I don't think people want that view. I'm <laughs> just throwing it out there. I know, but this was just the crotch shot, really, right out the gate. Yeah. Okay. Hopefully, you guys have a foam roller at your house, and you can do this one. And if you don't, you should have one because they're pool toys when you're not using them to mobilize your shoulders in this fashion. These are called angel wings. We're going to look for the widest fingers down, touching the floor the whole time, all the way up overhead. I want at least 10 of these. And then I also want you to bring your hands, so flip your hands up towards the ceiling right here. Reach your hands away from the foam roller. So we're actually like pulling away, pulling away, pulling away, pulling away. Reach for the floor, reach for the floor. And then palms to the floor and sweep them. Uh, back of your hands, sorry. <laughs> I appreciate you trying. Then you're going to do five of these guys, and then you're going to reverse it, because you'll feel when you reverse it. Go ahead and go. Reach, 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 And then reach for the ceiling. Up, 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 away. Then we're working on our scaps and a little bit of thoracic spine stuff, too. So it's all good. Cool beans. Like that one. Then our warm-up is a five-minute AMRAP. You're going to do five inchworm to push-ups. Inchworm. Push-up. Beautiful. 10 alternating world's greatest. Oh, yep. Beautiful. And 10 ball slams. I call this the frustration station. If you don't have a ball to slam, we can do ground to overhead. Same movement pattern. We'll alternate sides. Beautiful. Um, the other thing I like, too, is if you have plates, you could do a plate ground overhead. I like that as an alternate for the um, ball slam as well. And then 20 alternating lunges. Beautiful. Five minute AMRAP. Keep going through that until you're breathing heavy and sweating a little bit. Our workout today is a 30-minute EMOM. We have five stations. One of those stations is your rest. You are welcome. You're going to spend 50 seconds of each minute doing the exercise, um, then use that 10 seconds to transition to the next exercise. First exercise is calories on the bike. <laughs> we lost our bike. <laughs> Too big. <laughs> That's a bicycle. Um, if you don't have a bike, we're going to run or do double unders today. Uh, then we're going to have 50 seconds of max hand release push-ups. Watch Tyler's hands. They release, and he presses up. Notice that his spine does not change shape. Very nice, Tyler. Then we have 50 max Russian twists. You can do that with the slam ball. You can do that with nothing. You can do that with your dumbbell. Beautiful. And then the next station is going to be max ball slams. Again. Do some more. Get pissed. Um, again, if you're not doing ball slams, you're doing ground overhead with the dumbbell, just like we showed in the warm up. Today's point of performance is obviously max effort every 50 seconds. Give it all you got. Our scales today, we already went over, but a quick reminder, if you don't have a bike, um, you can use any cardio machine that you have available to you. You can run or do double unders or jump rope. And instead of ball slams, we're going to go ground overhead. When we are done, we are going to do a softball chest smash, all those Hand release push-ups are going to cause you to be nice and tight in those shoulders. So we're going to spend some time here. Make sure you're swinging that arm out and around as well. So we get some movement in there. Same. Cool. We're awesome. See you tomorrow. Nailed it. Nailed it.